Welcome back to our channel. Today, we're delving into a topic that's both crucial and often brushed aside habits that can harm your liver. But hey, hold up. Before you assume it's going to be a boring lecture, we're keeping things chill, laid back, and maybe even tossing in a joke or two. So grab your go to snack, get comfy, and let's jump in. All right, let's start with the basics. Your liver is like your body's very own superhero. It works tirelessly to detoxify your blood, produce essential proteins, and store energy. It's like the ultimate multitasker. But here's the thing, it's not invincible. It can only take so much before it starts to show signs of wear and tear. All right, let's start with the basics. Your liver is like your body's very own superhero. It works tirelessly to detoxify your blood, produce essential proteins, and store energy. It's like the ultimate multitasker. But here's the thing, it's not invincible. It can only take so much before it starts to show signs of wear and tear. Next up, let's chat about our eating habits. We're all guilty of indulging in some not-so-healthy foods from time to time. But constantly bombarding your body with greasy, fatty foods can really take a toll on your liver. It's like asking your liver to run a marathon after a big, greasy burger. It's just not fair. So, try to incorporate more fruits, veggies, and lean proteins into your diet. Your liver will thank you for it. Ah, uh, exercise. But here's the thing. Your liver loves it. Regular exercise not only helps you maintain a healthy weight, but it also keeps your liver happy and healthy. It's like giving your liver a little workout of its own. So, whether it's a brisk walk, a yoga class, or hitting the gym, find something you enjoy and get moving. All right, let's talk about something serious. Medication? Now, I know it's tempting to pop a pill and call it a day, but ignoring medication labels can be seriously harmful to your liver. Some medications, especially when taken in high doses or combined with alcohol, can be toxic to your liver. So, always read the labels, follow the recommended dosage, and if you're unsure, talk to your doctor. Ah, smoking, the ultimate bad habit. Not only does it wreak havoc on your lungs, but it's also no friend to your liver. The toxins in cigarettes can cause inflammation and scarring in your liver over time, increasing the risk of serious liver diseases like cirrhosis and liver cancer. So, if you needed another reason to kick the habit, there it is. Your liver will thank you for it. Now, let's talk about everyone's favorite guilty pleasure, sugar. We all love a sweet treat now and then, but overloading your body with sugary snacks and drinks can spell trouble for your liver. You see, when you consume too much sugar, your liver goes into overdrive trying to process it all. This can lead to fatty liver disease and insulin resistance, putting you at risk for type 2 diabetes and other health issues. So, go easy on the sweets. Your liver will appreciate the break. All right, here's a habit that often FLIs under the radar skipping regular checkups. We get it. Life gets busy, and going to the doctor isn't exactly fun. But here's the thing. Regular checkups are crucial for catching potential liver problems early on when they're easier to treat. So, make it a priority to schedule those appointments and keep tabs on your liver health. Your future self will thank you for it. And there you have it, folks, a rundown of some habits that can do a number on your liver. But here's the silver lining. By making a few simple changes to your lifestyle, you can give your liver the love and care it deserves. Whether it's cutting back on alcohol, kicking the smoking habit, or watching your sugar intake, every little bit helps. So, let's make a pact, shall we? Let's commit to taking better care of our livers starting today. And hey, if you found this video helpful, be sure to share it with your friends and family. Together, we can spread awareness about liver health and help others live their healthiest lives. Alrighty, that's a wrap for today's video. Thanks for tuning in. And until next time, take care and stay healthy. Bye for now.